da, 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 da. You see all the people working. Just ignore them. This is behind the scenes. So, what up, you guys? I'm from behind the scenes. You're. Wait, aren't you truly behind the scenes? Or are you behind, behind the scenes? Yes, I am truly behind the scenes. I am so behind the scenes. It's like Inception. Right here is a uh, secret, secret uh, meeting that they're having, discussing so, the film. Don't look at her. This is behind the scenes. Don't give footage to the editing group the night before we have to screen it. That's good advice. Yes. Here's here's what they here's you what see they the man desperately desperately need. The myth, the legend, Stomo. Good. So they need to just start having some footage. Look at that amazing looking man. One of the things that I was... So this is behind the scenes, literally. Because guess what? We're going into a filming. What's up? Nothing, just seeing behind the scenes here. Hey, what's your role? I am the investigator. He's the investigator. You look like you're worth investigating too. There we go. What about you? What's your role, dude? I'm Jonah. You're Jonah. I show up to class a little bit more often, but it's okay. That's fair. That's I mean, fair. It's, it's kind of even, I guess. Yeah, you know. <laughs> I guess. Uh, you know. And we're just waiting for like filming to start, you know, by a pipe. Jonah Martin, I presume? Yes, sir. How are you doing tonight, Mr. Investigator? Fine. Thank you. Okay, Bobby, how do you feel like you connect with your character? Uh, well, Cody's like kind of like a frat book guy, so like for the past week I've been wearing but nothing but like shorts that go all the way up to like my thighs and really like accentuate how muscular my thighs are and like backwards hats and whatnot. And like, I haven't done any cleaning in my house, which really helped me connect with a uh, frat boy. Behind the scenes, ignore me! So here we have our dedicated post-production team, hard at work. That zoom in doesn't work as well. I still like 19 better for a zoom in if we're going to transition to 23, because 23, like, uh, it, it feels less like an actual library, because it goes and it like zooms in and it starts like... So, uh, hey. How are you guys doing? I'm about to kill all Apple things. <laughs> oh, snap. Yeah. Is that a statement? Ten minutes are you going on the record? Uh, yeah, sure. Alright, that's fair. What about you? How's it going in the editing bay? Oh, Alright, just trying to find out what shots work, really. Alright, so this is about this part is what, with what we filmed already. They just took a bunch of shots and we're just putting them together? Mm -hmm. Yeah, right now we're gonna look for the, the opening bit. Yeah. So, Mr. Stomel, as the dead body and as the basic inspiration for this film, tell me, what was the vision that came from this? <laughs> um, ultimately, what this is all about is you take some amazing students who think really cool things and have really interesting conversations and you put cameras in their hands, don't really tell them how to make a movie, you tell them that 26 people are gonna make a movie together, and then they do. That's magic. That is magic. Now, answer me this question. You uh, died in the film, or rather, your character died, and uh, did you get into any method acting for that? Did you die yourself? Are you in fact dead? Are you a ghost right now? Um, you know, over the years, I've been in about four student films, and I have been a zombie, my dog has been eaten, and I have died on camera, and I have been a dead body. So all of my life's ambitions have been realized thanks to my students. I see. So basically, you're like a super zombie right now. Mm 